get some ID. I can double check, please. Uh, may I see your ID? Yeah, it's, it's right here. Okay, mine's my, my last name's Hines, then. Hines? Your name is Nelson. Yep, Deputy Nelson. All right. So, the, as far as ID. All right, well, I'm going to go hey, back to on. my computer. Am hey, I being right detained? Yep, yeah, you are for now. So. I am being detained. So What's the crime? What's the crime? Yeah. The failure to disclose identity at this point. Okay. Hey everybody, it's James Freeman. Recently I've been covering the nonsense going on in Cache County with the Cache County Sheriff's Department as well as the Logan Police Department. I'll put a link to those previous videos in the description so that if you aren't aware of them, you can catch up on it. The gist of it is that they hate transparency, hate being recorded, and refuse to release body cam footage that they're legally required to release by state law. They've tried multiple different tactics to get the spotlight off of themselves. None of those tactics included respecting people's rights, which is the only tactic that would have worked. They've filed charges against YouTube channel Cash Valley Transparency for interference, stalking, and harassment of police officers for recording them. They file false privacy complaints with YouTube, claiming that creators are uploading their bank account information, social security numbers, and other private information. These false claims are an attempt to get YouTube to take down videos of them acting inappropriately. Today I'm sharing this video from Travis Himes that was uploaded five years ago, but just recently received a false privacy complaint from the Cache County Sheriff's Department in an attempt to have it scrubbed from the internet. If you've never heard of the Streisand effect, Please Google it. Link to this full, uncut, unedited video on Travis Hines' channel is in the description below. Contact information for the Cache County Sheriff's Department that's trying to have all these videos scrubbed from the internet is also in the description. Mm. How are you? Good. Uh, everything all right over here? Yep. Okay. That's somebody called me that uh, saw you parked here, I guess, last night. Nope. No, I wasn't parked here last night. Okay, well, they saw this vehicle anyway, and so they, they called us to come check and to make sure everything's all right. Mm hmm Where are you trying to get to? Where are you trying to get to? Just finding out who you are is all, make sure things are fine. Yeah, things are okay. I have no complaints. Okay. You mind if I check your ID and know who you are? And... May I see your ID? Yeah, you bet. It's right here. Oh, all right. De Deputy Nielsen. I can... Sheriff's office. I can make a name tag too, I guess. Yeah, do you have any ID I can double check? I mean, I see your ID. Here. <clears throat> you can just stay right there for now. What? Am I'm I just... being detained? No, I'm just talking okay. to you. Yeah, I just stopped over here to get some food and I was going to go back to my computer in the library. Okay. So. Okay. Yeah, some ID. I can double check, please. Uh, may I see your ID? Yeah, it's, it's right here. Okay, mine's my my last name's Hines, then. Hines. Your name is Nelson. Yep, Deputy Nelson. All right. So the as far as ID. All right. Well, I'm gonna go hey, back to on. my computer. Am I hey, being right detained? Yep, yeah, you are for now. So I am being detained. So What's the crime? What's the crime? What's the yeah? The failure to disclose identity at this point. Okay. As most of you already know, in order to be legally required to give ID in any state, you must first be suspected of a crime. This deputy already articulated that he does not suspect Travis of a crime, and therefore it's not a crime for Travis to not ID. Reference Utah section 77-7-15. At this point, Travis is being illegally detained, and he's about to be illegally searched. Well, so, I just told so you my last name. Okay, what, what's your first name? Okay, what's your first name? Delta 93. And then I'll, you know, go ahead and tell you my first name. Negative, he's a little 1035. <clears throat> so I'm being detained, right? Right. And the crime is what? Do you have a physical on that individual? What's the crime? In Utah, I'm a little it's confused. A failure to disclose identity. Okay. So that's all it is. Well, There's I asked you to there. identify your, your, who you are, and so you know you, you showed me your name, so I told sure. you my name. What's your birthday? What's your birthday? I, I don't need to tell you that. For, well, then, for this job. I'm asking. You know, you're is asking it Travis? me. Yes, that's yep. Okay. What? What's your birthday, Travis? All right. What's your birthday? 
Okay, we're not, we're not, we don't have to go that route. Well, it's uh, back and forth, right? So we're, have, we're just for, having for a conversation. Job, no. we, we don't have to disclose our Well, why should birth, I? Little, what? Our birthday, but you would have to. Tell okay, why person. Why am I required to? Okay, well, let's, we're having a conversation, right? What's the yeah. crime that I'm committing? As of right now, there's no crime unless you don't want to exactly. Your, unless you don't want to give us your information, then it is a crime. In case you haven't heard, I've offered training seminars to these deputies multiple times to help them to stop violating people's rights. But Sergeant Openshaw became defensive with me when he found out that he doesn't know everything, which is probably why these deputies refuse to learn anything. If they're so sure that they know everything and have nothing to learn, then they never will learn. And if they never learn, they'll continue to gain the spotlight being stars in viral videos showing bad cops. As far as moving forward, in, in uh -huh. future incidents, um, what, 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 what do you think we should do about uh, getting training for the deputies out there at Cache County? Would, would you guys like me to come uh, out and teach a seminar for you? I, well, I mean, we have plenty of training that we go to. So are people just, are, are the deputies just not listening or are they not being taught properly? Which, I mean, which one is it? Well, I'm not going to sit here and continue to debate this with you anymore. I've got other things I need to do today. You know, in the future, just don't be defensive yeah. with me about what you don't know, okay? <laughs> Dude, I'm not, I'm not being defensive. It's okay. In the future, don't jump to conclusions about things that you don't have all the information on. Dude, it's okay. You don't have to know everything. I'm telling you, I'll teach you. You just got to open your mind. All right. I don't need you to teach me anything, so you have a good one. I'll talk to you later. All right, you well, talk. that's why I'm asking for your information, and I'm willing to trade information with that. Well, he gave you his name. Yeah, I, I, well, I, didn't know, I don't know he your first his, name. It's B, what does B stand Delta for? His ID for. is Delta 93. That's what you need. To I don't know what that means. <laughs> what, what is, is B your first name? Yes. It is. Okay, what's your first name? Brooks. Brooks, okay. Mm -hmm. All right. It's your Travis? Yes. What's your birthday? And, oh, oh, okay. May I have your birthday? And actually, no. All right. Well, I'm willing to give mine, but you're not, so I don't understand okay. what the deal is. Travis, we, we're here because of you, not because of us. We're just trying to what? figure out. We're not saying you're in trouble. We're just trying to... Yeah, I know. Uh, there's no crime being committed, right? Or there, what you're there saying... Is. Okay, there, I'm being detained because there's sure. a crime being committed. Well, because you're not giving us your ID. I'm willing to identify are. who I am. Well, let's... Just identify. Well, we, we're having a conversation, we can right? Ourselves after the fact. We are. We are. What? What do you mean? What's after, after, after the fact of what? Of you giving him your information. My what information? What Birthday am I required to? Birthday or picture ID, any kind of identification. Okay. So it is part of the Utah law. For for identifying yes, myself, which yes. I did do. I I told you my name's Travis. Which that includes your birthday. It's part of it. You know, and you you got my last <laughs> name right. Mm -hmm. Okay. How do you spell it? Oh, sure, it's H-E-I-N-Z-E. -E. H-E-I-N-Z-E. -E. Yes. With an E on the end? Yep. And you're, you're what, N-I-E-L-E-S-E-N? -E -E What's your birth, date of birth? Okay, may I have yours in, in return? Actually, that's, no. That, okay. That, that's not well, how what's, it works. We're identifying each other, right? But... I, I, I need to know to who you our, are. Our birthday out is still totally different than what we're getting. It's to totally here. different. It is. Okay, you don't have to identify who you are yet. I have to give you all. I have our, to. Our what what else do you need to know? You need a urine sample too. What, what all are we trying to get at? Sure, if you want to. What are we it, trying I'm to? Asking for that. What am I trying to overcome for this uh, this law that I'm breaking? To disclose your full identity. Okay, may I have yours as well? No. He told you what oh, his name you, was. I told you. Yeah, I, I said my name too. But we need to know who you what, are. What is that going to... How about your picture ID? I showed you mine so you I, can show me yours. Oh, I didn't quite see it. Let me take another look. If you pull yours out, then we'll... Uh, well, we'll okay. Sure, yeah. It's it's in this bag here. I can as as pull it out. Man, see you. No, nope, You're going to pull nope, a weapon nope. on us? You're going to get no, one go ahead, on go you. Ahead. You want to reach it? You want to... Reach it? You wanna... Okay, if you're going to pull a weapon out of there... No, there's no... It's, it's, my ID's in my bag. Okay. You can reach in there if you want. Yeah, you want to feel it? You want to feel it? Yeah, go ahead. Where's it at in there? Well, it's, it's in that pocket that's open now, so... Okay. In this pocket here? No, 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 it's in the smaller pocket. Yeah, yeah, right in here. One. Yeah. So, yep, that's it, that's right. It's a that's a, no, it's that, you had it. It's a smaller, yeah. Just it's inside that. there? Yep. <clears throat> well, no, 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 may I see, may I see your ID in exchange? That's, that's how it works, right? May I? Yeah, uh, well, I'll we you show yours. you. I'll show you mine. You show me yours, right? Well, may I have your ID? Your what's your first name? Let's see B your B A T T. Let's pull that out for now. What? What? And we'll go that route. As long as you don't have any warrants, 
you're, you're on your way. Is that what you're worried about? No. I have nothing to hide. I'm just asking for you not to... You know, you also disclose who you are, too. We have Bart... We have... Bart... Bart well, Sheen. Disclosed who <laughs> okay. Sean Bart Sheen. All right. I mean, you're Stephanie asking me for Nelson, my... Stephanie Nelson, yeah, yeah. Sergeant right. Bart Sheen. All right. And what, what's your first name you said again? I think you told me, but... D-Bats? Oh, you, you don't have to tell me your first name? Is that... Not right now. Okay. All right. Yeah, I have nothing to hide, but you okay. I mean, you guys seem well, to have, have to worry you guys that. seem to have something to hide. So you might have something that you're worried about. I, I just don't understand if it's a demand of me to identify myself. I also ask in return well, we're here for, a for a identification we're, as well. Was concerned about just so we're here. Yeah, and it gives them permission. No, it gives you guys permission to harass me. Well, pretty much, you, cause somebody calls you. Harass, somebody calls you, and that gives you permission to say this guy is a bad guy and well, start harassing and pull your gun out on me. It gives you permission to do that stuff. And it's amazing. It's strange. You know, people probably don't even know who this caller is. It's just a stranger who calls, and all of a sudden, I, I can become a bad guy and get a gun pulled out on me. No one, no one said you were a bad guy. Well, I got a gun pulled out on me, so, I mean, there's an there's inclination of that. We are just trying to identify it. Yep, yeah, and I'm just asking for identification in return, once again, as we, you know, we repeat ourselves. <clears throat> But yeah, I'm, I'm at the, I mean, I'll tell you, I'm, I'm at the library, and, you know, I have my computer over there. I just come over to eat. You know, it's it great timing. You know, I was sitting in here for maybe 10 minutes, and I get three three cop cars. I mean, I wasn't parked here for 10 minutes, but I was just sitting in here eating for 10 minutes, and I get three cop cars. And I, mean, I thought this was a public area. I mean, I, I thought it was okay to, to park yeah, here, right? It. You can have that back. So All right. As far so, as the concern yeah. of the citizen that called us, okay, that, that's what we wanted to check on. And oh, am I being detained? Yeah. Right now, you're good to go. Okay. Unless you have any questions for us. <laughs> Contact information for the Cache County Sheriff's Department is in the description below, as well as a link to this original video. Keep in mind that just a week ago, the department filed a complaint with YouTube, claiming that the deputy's privacy was violated in this video. Imagine being such a piece of trash that you violate someone's Fourth Amendment right to privacy and then claim that because they recorded you doing it, your privacy was violated.